The United States has confiscated the assets of the family of former South Korean President John Tu Hwan. The U.S. Justice Department says it seized 500,000 U.S. dollars that uh, John's daughter-in-law had invested in a company in Pennsylvania. In a statement on Wednesday, the assistant attorney uh, for this case said the former president had received some $200 million in bribes from Korean companies while in office and had laundered his ill-gotten gains in Korea and the U.S. In February, the uh, U.S. authorities seized more than $700,000 from the former president's second son following a house sale in California. John Duhan, now 83 years old, took power after the 1979 assassination of longtime military ruler Park Chung-hee and was president for eight years, which were tarnished by a vast amount of corruption.